Nice one, Chloe. Mom's gonna love the new look. I bet long Max Silver traded her hat for beer and booty long ago. How do I want to express my teenage angst today? I really should get going. I used to love skateboarding. It's the only mode of transportation that doubles as a middle finger to authority. Mom said I was too young to go. She was wrong, and it was awesome. As awesome as some of those shows with Elliot were, they were nothing compared to Firewalk last night. As awesome as some of those shows with Elliot were, they were nothing compared to Firewalk. Max made me this mix CD years ago. And because it was Max, not a single song was pirated. Fun fact. Shark babies eat their siblings in the womb. Maybe that's why I'm an only child. Used to dream of riding a unicorn as a kid, but then all the unicorns died. No more unicorns, no more princesses, and no more fucking rainbows. Words of wisdom, don't fail me now. Just ask Steve Jobs. Adapt or die. <laughs> Bask, ye mortals, in the light of the glowy bear. Dad was so proud of me for winning that stupid science fair. Man, I am killing it this year. Somehow, I don't think Mom's going to feel the same way. Yeah, no one needs to see that. Thank you. I'd like to think my humor has improved with age. Better living through chemistry. That really was Rachel Amber. And she saved my life. How was last night even real? One of these days, I'm actually going to use you to do my homework. Ask Miss Arcadia. 
You're the only source of info I trust in this town. Wait, what? Who? What photo? I have feelings about this. Most of them are not good feelings. Shit, where's my phone? It's not here. How drunk was I last night? Chloe, I said breakfast. Guess I better try calling my phone with mom's. Okay, mom's phone is probably in her room. I can use it to call mine, then figure out where the hell I left it. The preferred towel of Captain Bluebeard, scourge of Arcadia Bay. Mom's hiding her gray hair to impress her boyfriend. Maybe gray hair's his kryptonite. Maybe I should dye my hair gray. Home sweet home. Whoever said you can't go home again was probably from Arcadia Bay. And he could go home again. He just didn't want to. Mom's old engagement ring. Supposed to be mine, if I'm ever stupid enough to get married. Grade B? Fuck you, Arcadia Pawn. Wait, Mom's selling her engagement ring? I made this for Mom when I was like 10 years old. If she wore it now, I'm not sure which of us would be more embarrassed. I hate that she hides all our old pictures of Dad. You don't deserve to be stuck in a drawer like this. Dad, if you could see us now. Ah, Mom. Bad enough that David comes here for dinner. Mom's finally making her bed again. I guess that's a good sign. It's weird that mom's always hoarding these old catalogs. It's not like we have any money. I want mom to be happy, but not like this. Not like this! Sometimes you have to get knocked down lower than you've ever been to stand up taller than you ever were. Blech. Don't give up on yourself. A single spark can start a fire that burns the entire prairie better. I should call my phone. How 
can mom look at this every day and not see what a tool she's dating? Sounds like my phone is definitely nearby. Ugh, I drank way too much last night. Or was it just enough? There we go. Wonder how many calls I've missed. Yeah, yeah, okay. I think I saw Mom's purse in her room. Oh, can you grab my cell phone too? No more dawdling. I need to talk to you. Yeah. That really makes me want to hurry. Coming, Mom. Finally, you can put my purse on the dining table. Might still have time for breakfast if you hurry. Dining table, here I come. David's here so early. Mom calls him just a friend, but look at him. He's pretending he didn't just spend the night. And you never saw the condoms, Chloe. You never saw the condoms. Dad took these photos. Now that David's staying over so much, I wonder how long it'll take Mom to shove them in a drawer somewhere. Chloe, I don't have all day. Would you get over here already? I should see what Mom wants before she strokes out. Mom doesn't want me to know, but it's pretty clear her boy toy, David, hasn't worked in like a year. Any letter from Blackwell is never good. Is Mom having trouble with payments again? My scholarship doesn't cover everything. <sighs> like I need another reason for Principal Wells to get on my case. Aren't you glad you left for Seattle, Max? <sighs> and never looked back? Family pick used to hang here. I... Wow. I can't actually remember which one. <laughs> Hard to believe I was an 8th grade science athlete. Did I peak in middle school? It's my job to water these plants, but it was Dad's job to remind me, so nobody's fault, really. From when Max and I spilled Mom's wine. I think the only reason Mom hasn't recarpeted is so she can stay mad at me. We're already supporting one. Thanks.
Made that for mom in an art class when I was like five. She was never a smoker, but it's cool. I was never an artist. Wait, those aren't mom's keys. And these would be David's keys. There's probably a better place for them than the ashtray I made mom. Like his home, maybe? Feeling trapped? Right there with you. <laughs> Little dude's like, what the hell just happened? Shoot. I was hoping David could get a job on a container ship. To Japan. Why do I suddenly want to get some fireworks? This is Principal Ray Wells. Let me be emphatic. I have an enormous stick inserted into my butt. Thank you. Also, Chloe, you're poor and in trouble. Dad's old swear jar. We spent the last of his curses on bus fare and milk. How can bacon smell so good, but I'd still rather stuff these sugar bombs in my mouth? Pot roast? Mom hates pot roast. It's not that I'm ungrateful. It's just that... When your mom works in a diner, you're not always in the mood for diner-type food. <laughs>